point. Listen, man, I I feel your struggles, dude. We have Luke Bomber. He says shirts, nigga. Oh shit, my bad, Luke. All right, let's see. What kind of shirt designs do you have, Luke? I want to see this shit for myself. What you got for me, bro? Let me see this. Um, please understand where this is taking you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. Just open the fucking link. All right. Jared? Why would you put Nigga? Are you kidding me? Wow! Really? Listen, Luke, are you dead ass, my boy? Luke, are you dead ass? Wow, you asshole! <laughs> you fucking asshole! Why would you do this? <laughs> Alright, you know what? Fuck this. You know what, Luke? I'm tired of your bullshit. Donate $50 to help me out. And then you give me some bullshit. Like, how come you can't just be on one side? How come you can't be on the, hey, I'm going to contribute to help Etika and to keep him supported and to help him run his channel? No, you also have to be on the, I'm going to fucking put Etika on a subway shirt with that nigga Jared. You know, I got... I'm so tired of you, <laughs> nigga. Are you dead ass? You gonna come over here and embarrass me like that? I thought you had a legit shirt idea. What the fuck is this? I can't put this on no goddamn shirt. First off, it's not funny. Why the hell would? All right, man. That, that was all right. You know what? Some of you guys might think it's funny, so it's whatever. Y'all can laugh at it. Have your fucking giggles. It's all good. But Luke, you're on my shit list now. Actually, as a matter of fact, I think you've been on my shit list. But be happy. You've been bumped up to a higher position. Now I have more priority in giving you shit. Real fucking clever, man. You know what? To be honest, that actually was kind of creative. Nobody ever fucked with me by sending me a damn shirt design before and have it be some fucked up shit like this. So, okay. You know what? As a matter of fact, I'm not even mad. Let me put her on blade away. Some of you are probably going to be like, you left your cat, but you took your fucking knife with you. Yes, I did. I'm going to leave her on blade right there and hope that at some point during the night, I don't accidentally jump up and down on the bed and stab my black ass with that nigga. Please put the knife down. <laughs> Everyone's worried. They're like, Etika, please put that fucking thing down. Okay, all right. You know what? Props. That was creative. Fun little, fun little thing to do. I mean, I, I don't know how off. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. Oh no. Oh, oh no, Luke. It's fucking Luke. Oh god damn it. Wait a minute, nigga. Wait a minute. Guys, I'm out. I gotta go. I gotta set my shit up. But trust me, you'll be seeing more of me. Oh shit! Wait, hold on a second. What? Yo! Yo! This nigga look fun with a three hundred dollar donation. Shit! Shit! Damn, my boy, chill. Oh no, Luke. I'm supposed to get work done. Now you're bringing the nigga out of me. You're bringing the nigga out of me. No, why'd you do it? Why did you do it?
fresh. General, you face the high prince of Ice Tea Kingdom. DJ Lennon. I challenge you to single combat! I will accept your challenge, High Prince. But I'm no general. I am Crown Prince. Fresh Discord. Long live the king. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh. Oh. What? Yo! Are you dead ass? Fuck did you even say in that message, dog? I don't give a fuck. Happy early birthday, my boy. Take eight shots for your boy. Four hundred that's almost half a grand. Almost half a grand in one fucking go <laughs> Okay, hold on a second. Want some real shit? Got to be on some real shit right now. Wow, Luke. This dude is fucking crazy stream last night you know that I donated $400 to him and I'm pretty sure as you watch Attica streams you know that I've donated a lot like a lot <laughs> I think I've almost reached like $3,000 in donations and it's this video is basically an explanation on like how I'm managing the video. All of my donations did come from me and from what I made I didn't use a credit card I didn't use my parents money it all came from me and now you guys want to know how I get this money and what I do so basically well first off just to let you know I'm 17 years old so I don't really have a place I'm living in my dad's right now this is my room as you can see just, as you can see, this is my Nintendo Switch, okay? Uh, and my whole shelf of Amiibos and like other shit. So, there's that. But anyways, uh, so what I do for a job, I work at a casino. I'm pretty sure I mentioned it before in Etika Stream before. But, I don't know, a lot of people, I don't think like, like they forgot, I, mean, I, I don't know. I don't really remember a whole lot from streams, but... I work at a casino, and I work at a restaurant there called 
Well, I don't want to give it the name, but yeah, just say I work at a restaurant there, and what I do, I'm a buster. I just clean up tables, uh, put stuff away, put dishes away. That's what I do, okay? I ain't doing no drug money or any like illegal shit, so there's that. So how much I make uh, every, well, every around like two weeks. I make like um, $400 every two weeks, and I also get tips. That gives me about like uh, another about like a hundred dollars every week so that's how much I make and it's just basically like since I pretty much got all I, all I pretty much want I already got my switch uh, I don't really need anything else right now so what do I do I just donate to Etika and it's just it's mainly because like I Etika is definitely my favorite YouTuber. I, Luke Bomber saying, yo, Etika, you mind if you could check my last donation? I did something special for you. Oh, Luke, wait a minute. Luke, stop it, Luke. You know I saw that shit. <laughs> Luke Bomber is the most ridiculous nigger I've ever had on my streams. That's one hell of a title right there. Because he did this dumb shit. Look at this. This nigga took a picture for his... Is this your senior? No, this is his school ID. The nigga took a pic with the Joy-Con boy shirt and the Joy-Cons in hand. You you know this is going to stay with you for the rest of your life, right? He immortalized the Joy-Con boys in the most effective manner that I've ever seen. Is this what you sent me as your donation before, Luke, that you wanted me to read up on because I missed it? I saw... I was waiting to talk about it on stream, so niggas could roast that ass! <laughs> this nigga fucking put a fucking Joy-Con boy shirt on his goddamn ID! To be honest, as much as I wanted to roast you, Luke, I can't lie. It's kind of dope, alright? You have some small hands, my friend, but it's kind of dope. <laughs> Luke Bomber, all in good fun, no actual harm intended, you are a legend. Never let anyone tell you otherwise. You will be immortalized on this YouTube channel for the entirety of what's left. My nigga Luke Bomber hitting the goddamn boys. Can I get a hold up? We them boys! We them boys, nigga! We them boys! You already know the goddamn mantra, the motto, it's all been said before. We gonna say it again, we gonna add to the list. We them boys, nigga. Them Joy-Con boys are here, baby. You see the Joy-Cons, right? This isn't a game. This ain't a game. Nigga, look at all the Joy-Cons that I own. I got the yellow one. I got the gray one. I got the blue one. I got the red one. I got the Pro Controller. I got the Kamui. And I got me the exclusive European slash Japanese Splatoon 2, um, well, A good Joy tactician has nothing to fear. You can't say that I ain't a Joy-Con boy when I rep the Joy-Cons every day. Niggas are like, oh, Etika, use the Pro Controller or some Fuck the Pro Controller! Suck my dick! I'm a Joy-Con boy! Do you think there's any kind of misunderstanding with the title of that? No! A Joy-Con boy means a Joy-Con boy, and I'm gonna be one of them until the damn day I die. I use these things for everything, man. Niggas wanna shit on me talking about, oh, you ain't gonna be able to be good with a Joy-Con controller. I was murking niggas in Splatoon. Until I played with a few people from the tournament that I went to at Nintendo New York City the other day, and they had my ass 